All right, Alter Noops Nation, my name is Reed Nelson. This is Izzy Alkafas. This is This Week in Rec. Winter 2016, opening night. Um, uh, we got a few things to talk about. Let's, let's, let's start tonight, actually. Fresh in our mind. Barracudas win in triple overtime. Tony DeBoer with a pretty nice three to send it into triple overtime. Um, I got the clip. Let's run it. That was Tony DeBoer. They ended up winning by five or six. Uh, both teams didn't want to win. They were just turnover city at the end, but the Barracudas pulled it out. Um, pretty good game. Over here, the Fob Five, was that Fob Five? What, what happened? 84 49, Fob Five, plus Mike Byrne, plus Dustin DuPont, lose to the Supersonics. What the heck was that? I'm not quite sure. Uh... I have no idea. I, the The real issue was Mike wasn't calibrated right. Mike, Mike, um, he must have got some sort of swag that was just not right, and it just kind of filtered everybody else. I'm bl I'm blaming Mike, Mike's dealer. It was it was rough. Um, but let's talk a little bit about Mike Byrne. He's back after a six season break. I want to say, give or take. Yep. Um, More than that, six season, like a year and a half, two years. Two and a half years, I'd say ten season break. I mean, once you guys get gelled, you'll be. I mean, I mean, you'll probably end up winning six or so games this season. I'm not worried at all. Um, Mike Byrne back. I know it's cliche, but what's it mean? If we play like we did tonight, probably nothing. <laughs> uh, it means that we got a really tall guy um, on our team. Tonight was a little. It was. I can't. Exp I can't even explain it. We had some guys were face guarding, some guys were doubling like. <laughs> leaving backdoor cuts. Uh, you, they probably could have just, the statistician probably could have just taken the layup line and just done stats off the layup line. That's basically what their stat line was. They probably had 20 layups tonight. Okay. Uh, Adam Kidd returns. Free ballers easily dispose of the Bulls. You want to be on um, <laughs> you want to interview? Bulls are, let's just say that I, <laughs> Let's just say the Bulls are a little bit of a mess. Oh, yeah. uh, Mike Wiskus and Corey Hairston at the end of the game were shouting at one another. Um, and I believe Anthony Thompson made a comment. He's like, I hope he doesn't go after Wiskus because there's going to be about 40 guys on his back if he does. Uh, but there's, there's trouble in Bull, Bulls Nation. What's Gino going to do? I don't know. Because you can't switch teams now. They're locked. If, if Mike Mike's, or if, if uh, Wiskus is going to do that, he better have some long-term care insurance because it's a long time in the nursing home if he gets, if he gets beat up by that guy. Um, I don't know what Gino's going to do. He's probably going to have to do a better job of um, rotations. Figuring out, he, he's putting together wrong fits. Yeah. I mean, the, the team, I was watching from over here, and it was just, so awkward like the players are just it doesn't fit it's just a bunch of guys he knows and you put them together um he's got some homework to do he's got some real homework to do. your favorite team the magic johnsons is these magic johnsons lose in double overtime to the blazers uh event uneventful ending after we all waited for like 15 20 minutes i don't even think there's a highlight worthy of of uh of showing it's no. a good game though it, great game it was i mean magic johnsons were missing Zao, obviously, you know, like, <laughs> that's I mean, that's, that's 136 less points they had tonight, which is a good showing. I mean, considering that's 236 points that they would have put up tonight. One, one of the shockers, and I'll leave him nameless, said, if you think he's so rich, you, you are more than welcome to pay his student loans. Uh, which one of those guys is educated? Okay, I don't know. Here's the thing. I mean, not one guy, not one player the entire night was like, guys, I don't know. This is probably not a good idea. What are we even talking about right now? We, we're not. We're not there yet. Pause. We're gonna make pe we, people wait till the end. Um, okay, I gotta give a shout out to the Scorpions. They lose by 30 to UANO, but total free agent squad. Uh, only one guy who's played before. Ten guys. They were all up and cheering for each other. They were all working their ASSs off the whole night. It was really refreshing to see from a free agent squad, and I'm super jacked about watching them the rest of the season. They're not going to win more than two or three games, if that, but they, they're they going to work their 
their butts off the whole game. And, and it was just, it was so refreshing to see because I've, it's been a while since we've had a free agent team. And this was, it was great. So great job, Scorpions. You, you know, takes them down easily by 30. Uh, and then the other 7 o'clock game, um, Green Arrow loses to 12 o'clock boys. Um, 12 o'clock that, boys, I think it's their pickup all time. Oh, that's, that's cute. That's yeah, that's cool. cute. Uh, and I'm blanking on his name, and he's brand new, and he actually blinked when I took his profile photo. Uh, Dewan oh, Davis. Dewan Davis. Maybe he blinked because he didn't want you to maybe see his college profile picture, so he's like trying to like hide his face. Listen, Do think, I don't think he did. I don't think he played college. I, I've had people come up to me. They found Dewan Davis. Is it him? Who knows? He's a good player. You know how many Dewan Davises are out there? Probably. I mean, he, handful. The ones that you put, pulled up on your phone were like twelve shades darker than that Dewan Harris. I don't think that's him. Okay, so anything else, Fridley? Fridley way. We covered every game. Yeah, yeah, we did. Yeah. Okay, Roderick Powell returns to Uncle Drew's kids. Um, one of the top three best rec players in the last three, four years. What do you think? Who's who? Ro- oh, Roderick Powell? Powell. Uh, yeah, I, I mean, most talented, absolutely one of the most talented for sure. I mean, you, you still got Chris and Jansen. Jansen. Your favorite. He's uh, definitely my favorite. My favorite. Uh, you, I mean, yeah, he's probably not the top three, but he's got phenomenal talent. Probably the most gifted. Yeah, I'd say that. Rebels lose okay. to the Squires. Um, they were at full strength, yeah. relatively full strength. Well, who are they missing? Uh, I mean, Pat, but I don't know if Pat's playing with him this season. But other than that, they were at full strength. Ryan, uh, uh, other Ryan, um, Dupont, Dustin, Cody, Paul, they were all there. Cody's back. Cody's back. Um, a lot of players returning this season. What did you, you – you guys were playing during that time, yeah. five-on-four win over Miller time. Four-on-four. Four four oh, yeah, you guys did go four-on-four. That's very very noble of you. you. Um, so let's let's get to it. 136 points, all-time record, all-time ultimate hoops record. Now, I'm going to say my piece first, and then I'll let you say your piece. So when I heard about it, I was – I was a little bit uneasy, and I was like, ugh, it's embarrassing. And honestly, everyone involved should be embarrassed, and here's why. The Shockers should be embarrassed because they ran up the score on a 5-on-4 team. Zhao is is not the victim here. As you mentioned today, he put it on his Facebook page. He was owning it just as much as, if not more than anyone. I'm embarrassed for the league because it makes us look not legitimate. The Crusaders should be embarrassed for allowing it to happen. Listen, at the end of the day, someone's got a double team or triple team and do something. He took 74 threes. When I interviewed Zhao, I was assuming he maybe hit 70 to 75 percent of them, but no, he only hit 50. Only hit 58 percent. He took 74 threes, almost two threes a minute. Everyone should be embarrassed. Um, I don't necessarily want to put it out there. That's why I mean it was kind of a footnote, but not really. What are your thoughts? Footnote, well, I didn't put a picture of Zhao on the front. I put, on. When was the last time we had a Wednesday night video? Last night. Two of them. Jacob when Barton's. The, when was the last time we had a Wednesday night video? Well, last night. Jacob Barton's game winner. When was the last time before last I night? I don't remember. Exactly. Probably so when you tripped you pr- Monska. You, promo- you promote it on a day that this I mean, usually what happens is the Wednesday night games, if there's a sick play, we splice it into this week in Iraq. You decided to make it. You you promoted it. Oh, so I shouldn't. I shouldn't do more videos. No, you shouldn't. Okay, do Jacob Barton's. That one thirty six shouldn't never be. It should be scratched from the record. The, the box score should be deleted permanently. Okay. Well, here's the deal. It's not going to be deleted. It was a five on four game. You know, it, 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 I guess it is what it is. This is this is like what it should be in like Sh- Schamburg or whatever it is, or Bloomingdale, Schamburg, Schamburg, whatever. It it should be in one of those that type of box score should be in that those leagues not our league i mean it tarnishes wreck so what do we do because it happened we we take it out it's take like it out we just take it out hey that's, 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 hey you have access take it out just take it out on accident whoops well we can't we can't do that but what can we do to prevent this type of thing in the future anything um if you go if a team goes five on four against you you do everything you can to step underneath every single shot i'm dead serious if, if 
if people are not going to respect you, you better you better have some dignity and, and, and stand up for yourself because that is some. I would never let somebody do that to me. I don't care. I don't care. The league can suspend me. They can do whatever they want. But I am stepping underneath every jump shot I can find if a team goes five on four and tries to do that. Like they they set out to just get Zhao shots. Oh, absolutely. He had one assist. It was ba- it, 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 honestly they treated them like they were the generals and it was the globetrotters. So not everybody saw what what you had had to say on Facebook today. Um, and if you want, go find UH Minnesota online. Like us, so you get all those updates. What what are your thoughts in general about how the Shockers acted? Oh, it's 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 pathetic. I mean, we we should be adults. Should be adults. It's a it's a rec league. I get it. But we should we should have some maturity and we shouldn't act like high schoolers. I mean that's something that people do in high school. Like they think that's cool. There's nothing cool about it. It's just a bunch of insecure white kids that think it's funny. And sure, they might have got a la- they they probably got a laugh out of it. But that just shows how pathetic they are. Wow. Okay. So I I, I want to give Jacob Barton his due. He hits a game winner with pro- it was probably seven or eight seconds left. Uh, so we'll run that real quick. We'll just run it over the us talking. I want to make. One really kind of interesting note, if you've been on our website lately, you've seen this Hard Rock video contest. We are legitimately giving away a five-night, five-day, full airfare, all-expenses-paid trip to any Hard Rock uh, destination in Dominican Republic and Cancun, I believe. Don't quote me. What? For It's a contest. UH what? is having a contest. What's the contest? So you post a photo kind of talking about... All, all, all the information is up there listed. I'm not. I'm going to butcher it, even though I, I even though I made the video with Alan. Um, but it is it is by far the best prize we've ever awarded. Really? We've, we've actually, you've actually never, you've we've never awarded we've, a trip to the Dominican Republic. We've never done anything like it before. You make so <laughs> no, much money. No, just a trip to Schamburg or, yeah, Schamburg. or Schamburg, as you <laughs> call it, which is actually kind of a Freudian slip. Sham. Yeah, it is Schamburg. Um. So so. At least click and look at it, but. You know, sometimes you look at those contests and you're like, oh, yeah, whatever. Well, like, there's like eight people who have entered it so far. So, I mean, enter. You have well, a legit chance. What's the chan- point of it? What's the point of it? It's just a sponsorship promotional thing. Who's sponsoring it? Hard Rock. Hard Rock Cafe. Or Hard Rock Hotels, excuse me. So they'll pay. F- what do they? Okay, whatever. We'll read. They pay for everything. So, airfare, hotel. To where? And it's Dominican? Dominican Republic or Cancun, I believe. And it's, uh, what do they call that when you go to a, a resort and they pay for everything? It's called... All-inclusive. All-inclusive. Sharp. Very sharp. Uh, any final thoughts? Week one. Um, Sir. I, uh, on the ass, I, let, I called it all white kids. I apologize. There's one more ass hat, and that's the, the Asian kid, Zhao Li. So you were, you were painting Zhao as a victim at first, and no, I, no, I no, called no, you I, out I on that. I didn't mean to necessarily... Here's the thing. Zhao didn't... They... They created the, the problem. They peer pressured him. Well, no, no. It's like kind of like, hey, we're going to we're gonna get you a record. And Zal's like, okay, cool. I like points. You know, I'm a shooter, right? Um, so, yeah. And then he goes and gloats. Like, how are you? I would be embarrassed to put up a five-on-four game box score. Like, that is so lame. Like, that well, is... It's, I, it's, it's sad. I, I, I don't want to pick on Zhao because no, I, re- I really like Zhao. No, no, no. What, what do you, why but don't you want to pick on Zhao? Listen, you just picked on four guys yesterday. You thought it was listen, cool, right? When, when Zhao posted the, the, spread, uh, the, the box score, he only posted half of it. He only posted the upper half, I believe. I'd have to go back and look. I don't know. But it, either way, it's I don't it's think he posted the full box that, score. That you, that, man, what I, why do you have to blame me for this? What the, did I do? Because instead of talking about how the Crusaders, you, you know, got to be kidding me with that. Instead of talking about how you just, you just, the Scorpions got beat by thirty, and you're like, oh, the Scorpions are so awesome. Oh, we should give them all hugs and kisses, and they're such good teammates. But then the team that got blitzed by 130 points, but they 90 points, and who gave up halfway through no, the game, mind you? Dude, no, you realize that somebody scored 136 points and there was 181 points put up against the team and nobody went to the hospital. That is not that is not award worthy. No, okay? it is. No, it's not. So losing by 30 and congratulating each other is? Easy. You took you took 30 seconds to, to pat him on the back, but the Crusaders have been in the league for four You're years. You're saying because they didn't punch him? Oh yeah. That that's award worthy? Oh yeah. I mean that honestly, Please. I can't I can't imagine how difficult it is to not want to choke slam no. somebody the crusaders are just as much to blame because they let it happen exactly let it happen if they would have 
jump stepped under somebody's shooting that they didn't let it they wouldn't let it this happen. is a perfect example of how arguing with you is completely it's it's just unnecessary because you're going to find this ridiculous thing how I, how I should I don't have posted think it's that ridiculous you want to award them. You want no, me to no, no. post on the website that no, no, they should be awarded because they didn't hurt anybody. Are, are there times where you say things that you don't even actually believe yourself? Like right now? No. Sometimes. I, well, I mean, I, good I, job, Crusaders. You didn't injure anybody last night on purpose, and we would definitely appreciate that. So the headline tonight is going to read, Crusaders don't send anyone to well, hospital. Hey, nice job. You should just put Shockers win first Gold Cup. Because that was scores 136 points. They didn't win the Gold Cup. Gold, that, was, that was their championship. They're going to be in the record books forever. Shockers. Zhao Li. They're legendary. This was a good conversation. I appreciate it. Go Shockers. Thank you.